Praxis Prepper. Hey everybody, this is Praxis, and I'm next to the south-facing windows in the house that I'm working on building right now. I've been here all day cutting these rough openings to be just the right size for windows. It's been raining sawdust down on me, and it's also reminded me a lot of my last house. Whenever I wanted to make a cell phone call for my last house, I always had to hang out next to the south-facing windows in that house, and I could get a, a weak cell signal. Uh, from there. Uh, the rest of the house was covered in uh, a foil that really seemed to block a lot of electromagnetic radiation from coming into the house. That was, uh, you know, kind of a good thing, I felt, because I, I feel like, you know, more radiation is probably not a great thing, so whenever you can limit it, that's probably beneficial. So I kind of liked that my house was kind of, had that EMF kind of protection around it. Of course, the downside is I had to hang out next to the windows whenever I wanted to make a cell phone call or anything like that. Uh, as you guys know, uh, it's been all over the news, 5G. Uh, it's a new kind of uh, information uh, communications technology that looks like it's going to be rolling out. A lot of people are talking about, like, you know, we got to stop 5G because it's this terrible thing. It's going to turn us all into automaton zombies or kill us instantly or whatever, fry our brains. Uh, you know, some people are very excited about it. They think it's, they think it's a wonderful thing. But uh, whether you're for it or against it, it looks like it's going to happen. Uh, so I have set up an interview because 9 out of 10 of you guys responded to a poll that I put out and said that you guys would be interested in getting some hard facts from a real expert about this new 5G uh thing that's happening about the radiation related to it and uh, possibly some of the things that we can do to kind of like if it is a problem maybe protect ourselves a little bit uh, that interview is going to happen because everyone said loud and clear they wanted to, uh, they wanted me to do that so I'm going to be doing that and tonight at 8 30 Eastern Standard Time I'm going to be hosting a live stream this is the patreon only live stream I do one patreon only live stream per month and one for everybody this happens to be the patreon only live stream and um, I want to open it up to you guys. Do you have any questions, specific questions, for an electromagnetic frequency expert that I'll be interviewing in regards to this? I have all sorts of questions on my own, but if you have anything that you want to uh, know about 5G, you know, related to, you know, is it safe? Is it dangerous? If it is dangerous, you know, what can you do to protect yourself from it? Or any other kind of questions that you have, tune into the live stream tonight, 8.30 Eastern Standard Time, and we're going to uh, kind of compile a list of, you know, all the things that we want to make sure that we ask him. Uh, it relates to building the homestead, obviously, because, you know, as you're building a house or, you know, retrofitting a house, what are some things that you might be able to do to create some protections into that structure that could protect you from, you know, any kind of electromagnetic radiation that might be coming from outside? Because, you know, as, you know, uh, progress marches forward, it, it seems to invariably involve more and more exposure to these sorts of things. I don't think it, people have ever stepped back and, you know, and gone backwards on that. So this is something that keeps going forward. And like I said earlier, I think more radiation is probably more of a negative thing than a positive thing. The human body, is, you know, gets radiation all the time. It comes in from space. It comes in from everywhere. But adding to that, you know, more than our bodies necessarily evolved to cope with, you know, when we were back when we were evolving, if you believe in that kind of stuff like evolution. Um, uh, you know, that might be asking for trouble. So we're going to compile a list of any questions that you may have. So again, if you want to uh, join in on that live stream, patreon.com slash praxisprepper. The live stream link will be there and tonight at 8.30 Eastern Standard Time. In addition to talking about all the other things related to homestead building, we're going to compile a list of questions that you have for my electromagnetic frequency expert. That's it. Thanks for watching. This episode has been brought to you in part by Prescott Caliber Club and Jeske Defense Strategies. Prescott Caliber Club is a federally licensed firearm manufacturer and retail store specializing in firearms, survival gear, and producing great online content. If you want to thank them for supporting this channel, go check them out at prescottcalclub.com. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video. And if you'd like to support this channel, you can do so both through Patreon or PayPal.